Sorry guys, I lost the footage of me putting on this beautiful makeup. But what I used, what I did was I did, I used this elf blush. I'm going to try to find the footage if I can. This contour and how to contour you just have to go. So, now for my outfit. I'm going to show you my outfit that I'm going to be wearing for Valentine's Day. And I'm going, not on a date, I'm going on kind of a date, but with my family. So, yeah. So, I'm wearing this cute little dress that I got for Christmas. It's a red little real ruffle thingy right here in mine. I got it for Vlogmas. I got it for my school and if you want to see that video I uploaded it to YouTube. It's Vlogs by Aubrey. It's Vlogmas. So yeah it's for school. And then my cute little um leather shorts as you can see. As you can see I got them from JC Penney's. They were on sale. I just got them because I did. And then I forgot my thinky here was on sale at JC Pennies too. And then my leggings. My new leggings I just really got just recently. And I got them from from Walmart and they were regular price because I needed them for my field trip at school. So so yeah, now it's my makeup. So, um for my Valentine's Day makeup. Valentine's Day makeup, I'm going to be showing you what I'm going to be doing. So yeah, let's just get started. First of all, I'm just going to take off my glasses, because I have glasses. And then, I'm just going to, um, put on my Pure, sorry about that, Pure BB Cream. I'm just going to put it on like this. And I'm just going to blend that in. And then I'm going to blend that in with my, um, my beauty blender. My sister's actually. Alright. And then I'm going to, um, take, um, this. A general effect um, eye circle thingy that comes in a little thing like this. My sister's too. Put it under my eyes. I'm just gonna rub, and then I'm just gonna rub that in. And then um, I'm just going to. So, um, yeah, and then I'm just going to take my, my CoverGirl, um, um, foundation, no, powder, whatever it's called, and, and then put it on my face that helps stay your makeup on, and I'm using this brush that comes with two sides, and this side I'm going to be using later. I'm just going to take this side right here and just put it in here. You guys should know how to do this, so I shouldn't have to explain it. Whatever. And then, make sure you don't put on too much, or else it will show. Now, I don't actually really need makeup, that's why I'm not going dramatic with this makeup tutorial. For still, I'm still doing other stuff, but I'm not going dramatic because I'm just like, I'm young and I don't need makeup and I don't wear it. I just. I just want to do it because it's on a special occasion. So, yeah. Um, so then I am going to, um, so then I'm going to just take my eye cream on my eyes and, and I made this homemade and if you want to learn how to make this, then you're going to have to stay tuned on my channel, because I'm going to have a video coming up very soon. So just stay tuned if you want to learn how to make it. And I'm just going to put this on my eye. So, it's going to look very pretty. So after that,
that, um, so after that you just going to, um, grab some of your eyeshadow, and I'm using the eyeshadow, so, yeah. So, um, for my eyeshadow, um, I have this cream eyeshadow that I got, and then, this is not really pigmented, but, um, I'm still just going to use it anyways. <clears throat> and it comes with um a pink a per a pink pink purple a blue and then I meant yeah a blue and then a white and they don't show up but right now I'm just gonna use my the purple color first Put on both eyes and then I'm just gonna grab another finger and then put the pink on too and I'm just gonna go like halfway halfway. And after that, you can just blend them all together. So, um, so yeah. So I just do that just because I want to, just so it like, feels good and stuff. So, yeah. So the eyeshadows that I'm, I don't know, but I have this eyeshadow that I got from my grandma. Student, like all of this, I mostly got there because this girl at her work. So yeah. And this one comes with a lot of them and like a smoky eye color, even though I like that color. I'm not going to be using this palette because I'm not going for a sexy look because I'm not like a grown up or anything. But then I have this one that's like pink, purple, and stuff, which I'm probably going to be using. And then this one, which I, which is for smoky eyes too, but not really. I used the gold one there and I just blend that together. So, yeah. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this one, the ones that have all the pretty colors in them. And then, um, the first, um, The first color that I'm going to be, um, I'm taking is, um, is this dark pink color right there. So I just got my brush right here. And then I'm just going to put that on my eye. So, yeah. And, um, if you, never mind, sorry guys, yeah, if you want to see any more videos, um, comment them down below, because I don't have any ideas right now. So, after you put that on, just like that, I'm just going to, oh yeah, and I forgot to say, my brush comes with one of these <clears throat> thingies, that, um, a little contour thingy. And I got this out of the Victoria's Secret one. They come with like a smoky eye one. And yeah, I just got that out of here. And I'll show you what later. But, yeah, so I'm just gonna, now I'm just gonna take the purple color. And what you're gonna do, you're like, what? You're gonna put both of them together? Yes, you're just gonna put this on half of the eyelid. So, So, yeah. Sorry if I'm taking a little slow, guys. I can't really see. So, a little longer. Okay, after you put that on, you can see that it's on half of there. I'm just going to blend that in just a little bit with my finger. Not a whole bunch. Okay, now, now with, um, now I'm going to take the, um, pink color in here, the lighter pink that's up here, and then I'm just going to grab this side of it, and just put that on, and then you're just going to, like, go up here, and you're just going to go to the inner corner, and just go like that, it should get that in there, but this brush, it doesn't work that well, like, going like this, but it does work well. So, I have this other brush, too, that's actually meant for doing that. And I'm just going to actually, um, 
just do a little bit of that one. But yeah. So um so after that, um um after that yeah. And you uh, tell me down below and give this video let's get this video to like thirty or something something like that. Um, so wait. If you guys want to see, um, how to, um, make gel liner, then just comment down below and like this video. So, yeah. So next I'm going to do, um, uh, after I do that, um, sorry, I'm trying to think here what I'm doing next. I totally forgot. Oh, yeah. Now I'm just going to take this palette that I showed you before. And there's a lot of colors in here, but I use the gold one, and that's what I'm going to be using this brush for. I'm just going to grab that gold one here. Just get a little bit on so it will look something like that. And then this one, you're going to do the same. You're just going to rub that into your inner corners, or your crease, as it's called. And then, yeah. Um, if you use this brush, it would give you a lot more... Um, a lot more like it's going to be like bigger so you can see it better which I don't know I don't know if that's good or bad but whatever so um the next thing that I'm going to be putting on is um sorry guys I'm just having a little difficulties right now um And then I'm just going to be putting on some lipstick. And so, yeah. I don't get extreme about this stuff, but I got a lot from there. And I got, like, all of these colors, like, pinks, purples. And the most of them I'm going to be using are pink and pur are, like, pinks and, like, dark purples and stuff. So, um, yeah. And so, um, before I start with that... You can, to make your thing glow out with, you can put concealer on your lips or just on foundation. It can make it glow out better. But, yeah. So, I have these little eye thingies here. Whatever they're called. For, sorry, guys. Um, yeah. Lip liners. And, yeah. I'm just going to put one on. Um, yeah, it's like this, I don't know if I really like it, it's kind of like, um, it's kind of like, I don't know how to say it, it's like a uh, too dark of color, I guess, I would say, so, um, yeah, but, a lot of people like lip liners, but for me, um, no. I'm not, like, a lip liner kind of person. So, yeah, I'll just... And it's very pigmented, too. I don't wear lips, red lipstick, so... I'm just gonna take that off. Um... Mostly off. It, it may leave a stain, but I don't really know. Um, so, yeah. So, yeah. So, with my lipsticks, I have a lot of them. And just saying, yeah, just comment down below to see if you want to see a makeup thingy or a lip gloss collection. So, yeah. So, in my thingies over here, I'm just going to be looking for um, some very, um, like, pink colors and stuff like that, and just a little bit of, just a little, and some, um, purples, because those are colors that I go for, and, um, I found a lot of pretty ones, so,
so I found a lot of them, and um, I'm just going to be seeing what ones look better on me, so. I don't really like that one, this one here, so I'm just going to put that one back. Now I'm just going to try on some other ones. I don't know, like a too much brownish color for that one. Um... And, um, I like that color. It's not going to be my base color, though. That's for sure. Oh, and I didn't realize this. I thought this one was a purple, but it's actually a silver. Let's see when it turns up, turns up silver. Um... So, down to my last couple. Hang in there, people. I actually really like that color. Um, I'll keep that one up here. That color and okay. So this one's a very hard decision because I like um because I like a lot of them. So, um, so I think that I'm going to, um, first of all, I think I'm going to put on the darkest shade, which in my color is this one, and I'm just going to put that on my lips. And you don't have to do this if you don't um if you don't have a lot to, that you like and all. But since I like a lot, I'm just gonna have to do this. I'm gonna take the next lightest one, and then just put that in just a little bit. Don't put it all over. And then take your other one. And do the same thing. And then for my last one, which is the pink one, I'm going to do less of that one. So, um, um, so, yeah. And, um, so, the next thing that I'm going to be putting on is, um, hold on one second. I gotta clean off my hands. I did a lot of swatches and wiping off. But I have to clean my hands, right? Yeah. Okay, so. Sorry about the interruption. So, yeah. After I do that, um, I am. Oh yeah, and for a clean shut off, you can use um, a lip gloss, which I don't know if I really need it, but I'm just gonna go with it. I'm just gonna wipe around the edges, 
And this is a really good thing to have some wet wipes for makeup remover. And just to remove anything. In just case you get into something there that you don't want like I did. Okay, so after you do that, it's pretty um, simple, explanatory. Um, so next I'm just going to be grabbing my... my bronzer and I don't really know how to use bronzer and I don't really need it. I don't even know what it's for but whatever. And then so on bronzer you need like a type of brush that's like curved so that's why I was showing you this brush and it's kind of curved in the other one. So yeah I'm just going to take like the kind of curved brush add it into my bronzer. And then all you're going to do I don't really know how to use it, but make like um, a fish shape. And just go. So make a fish face and then go, and then go like this. Yeah. And I think there's different kind of color bronzer. So just get the color that matches you. Don't put a lot on because it might make your face weird. Just so use the other light side. And then since that might not look good with that, I'm just going to take just a pinch more, don't get a lot, and then you're just going to just make a nice finish and it's going to go up on your face like this. And just in case, like, it's your professors, and I'm really going to makeup, and I don't wear it, so just to make it if you guys think it doesn't look good, you can put it under there, but I don't know why you do that. So then, yeah, my face, your face should look something like this. Not exactly like mine, because you guys have a different face than me, of course. And then, um... The next thing you're going to take is your um, blush, and I have this e.l.f. blush, and I'm just going to um, grab it and then use the same set as I did for the um, thing, the um, powder stuff, the big brush, and just get a little bit of this. I don't really actually need it because I already have, like, rosy cheek reds naturally, but this, don't get a lot because this one, the e.l.f. one, stains it pretty good, so I just put a little bit on there gonna put a little bit on your face. And then um after that you're just going to um now I'm at now I'm going to put on my mascara to finish it off and I totally forgot to grab my eyeliner my thingy to crunch them so yeah and so, after you like curl your eyelashes with that thingy, I was scared of that thingy, you pinched me for. I'm just going to use the Flawless Volume Express um, um, mascara. I'm just going to put that on. You can do the bottom row too, but if I do the bottom row, then when I blink, it will do that, and I blink a lot. I'm sorry about that. And then I'm going to take this bold, big and bold darling thing eyeliner. I meant not eyeliner, a mascara. And this makes your eyes look way bigger than the other one. And it's a lot better too. When you open it up, it's like has a big fat thing that's kind of curved. I'm just going to put this on. And that, you can just use one, like you can just use this one or just one of them that makes your eyes go out big. Like this. You can see a tremendous difference. So you can just use this because, yeah, but I just like using both because that's what we usually do. Um, so, yeah, and I wouldn't wear this to school unless you're like a teenager and stuff, but I don't wear this much of makeup to school because I'm not like that girl. So, um, yeah. 
So that's my finished makeup look, and I'm not going to be doing the hair look because I just wore it the exact same as this. Like, I'm wearing it the exact same as this since we don't have time. So, yeah. Bye.